everyone i'm pavitra shrikanand a very proud cd student currently doing my post graduation at pgim at chandigarh i am currently at the unit of orthodontics and dentofacial orthopedics after scoring an all india rank of 2 in the general merit category i have completed my undergraduation at rbs dental college coimbatore Cracking an entrance exam is not just a competition between thousands of students. It's more of a competition with yourself. It's about having the right mentality and studying little by little every single day, even though you don't want to study at all. So Ryzen Sir is always there with you throughout each and every single step of the process. He'll tell you what for what subjects you're sub you're supposed to study the books, for what subjects you're supposed to study pulse, for which you're supposed to refer dentist or what other books, and he'll completely guide you of what to do and what not to do in entrance preparation because it's very easy to get deviated and study a lot of wrong things and for and lose focus of what is very important. Even he'll give you the emotional support that you require for entrance preparation. It's very easy to feel hopelessness, fear, anxiety. It's very it's It's very common. Each and every single aspirant has to go through each of these phases, and he is there for you. He he addresses you, and he knows how to talk to you, and he will motivate you to continue each and every single step of the journey. There's this common notion that you have to be very smart and very intelligent to be able to crack these exams. I'm no genius, no superhuman. I'm I'm like an ordinary person who is not very high fi. Did not get all high ranks. Was nothing like that. The only thing that you have to do properly is consistently work. You don't have to be very smart or very genius, but or but you do need to have lots of perseverance. You need to sit down and you need to study. I joined Bangalore live classroom courses. and um, i had to travel from coimbatore to bangalore uh, by train for for attending each and every class and that took around 16 hours and i knew that my fellow batchmates and seniors would have been studying for the entrance exam during that time so i had, I had no other option than to study in the train i got a lot of weird stares but right now it really doesn't matter i used to take my book out sit in the train there'll be people selling peanuts in one and there'll be babies crying in the other but i used to sit with my pulse and and i used to study and there's no like any good place or good time to study it's like you save up every second that you get and you hope to progress a little further and even if one thing goes into your head it's it's good and that's pretty much all you want because a multiple of little things adds up into one big result uh right before i gave my aims uh, pgi and jipmer exams sir had released a voice note voice note saying if you want to see just go and take it i would have listened to that voice note at least for at least 50 times right before i took the exam he literally like knows how to motivate you and gives and removes the self doubt that you have and and what i feel is that for entrance preparation you need to have the courage to accept that no matter what happens i will continue studying and that is very important even when i wrote pgi exams i did not expect to get a seat i was telling my dad on the car drive back i don't know i don't know the exam would seem kind of tough i don't know what will happen and and i got second hang it's not like i aimed I knew I go I was I will be able to get second rank no I ne- I you never know what will happen and you can never expect such things either the, what you can do is you can study each and every single day and hope for the best and keep a positive attitude and even if you don't get it you know that you're better than you were yesterday and that and that's all that matters in entrance preparation is that you don't lose hope at all and you continue each and every single day putting each and every single drop of your effort and progressing that's it there's no end to studying there's no end to entrance preparation